Good morning and welcome to my channel. My name's Julie and I'm losing weight following the cinema plan. This is my weekly Aldi shop and this week's a big one. Um, I didn't do a full shop last week and I don't think I did the week before. So this is some sort of stocking up um, the cupboards and the fridge and the freezer as well as my usual sort of weekly shop. Um, I have got some meal plans in mind for this week. Um, I'm not going to go through them in this video though because I'm going to do a separate meal prep meal plan kind of video. Um, but yeah, I'm going to jump in now and show you what I've bought um, because some of it's frozen and I need to get it put away. I'm going to start with the frozen stuff so I can get it put away because I've spent a bit of time getting it all out and uh, obviously it's starting to defrost. I've bought a tub of ice cream, um, that's for the family, not for me. Um, I've got some four berry medley, which is frozen fruit, which is for me. That's, I don't know if that's someone's mixture of speed and free or if it's just speed, but because it's berries, but... By the way, it's good on the plan. I've got garden peas, which are free. I've got a mixture of carrot, broccoli, and super sweet sweet corn. And I've got a separate bag of sweet corn and some mixed veg, which is green beans, carrots, and sweet corn. These are really handy for doing meal, especially for doing meal pack, um, because you can just stick them in the bento boxes and um, they'll be fine for heating up in the microwave. I've also bought a toffee pavlova. This is for the family. I did wonder whether I'd be able to have a piece because I thought it might be similar to the cream meringues you get in Tesco's or Morrison's, but actually for six for six a uh, six sixths I can't get my words out of this particular gatto, it's nine and a half cents, which is quite a lot, so I probably won't be having any of that today. Uh, I'm just gonna quickly put this frozen stuff away and then I'm gonna get on and show you the rest. Now the frozen stuff's away, I'll just do it in any order. So I bought a large 30 pack of crisps. This is the meaty variety. Um, I don't have those, so I haven't even checked the on them. I bought these Foodie Market um, bites. I've had these before and actually they're quite nice. Um, in the app, it's coming up with four and a half cents for the hummus ones and four and a half for the quinoa. It doesn't come up for the lentil sea salt ones, but I'm assuming it's about the same. So four and a half cents for those, which isn't too bad. I bought a multi pack of Cheetos, they're three and a half cents. I've bought a bag of spinach, that is for breakfast prep for this week. I've got some carrots, a large bag of carrots. I've got some peppers, so obviously these are speed. I've got some easy peelers and some pears. They're on special this week, so that's why I picked those up. I've got some kale, again, I'm just gonna prep that for during the week. I've got some red onions. I've got two packs of the candy floss carrots. I think they're called cotton candy cat grapes, sorry, not carrots. <laughs> what am I thinking of? Um, one pack of this is for you and because he really likes them. I didn't even get to try one last week, so I bought two packs so we can all have some as well. Um, I've got some strawberries and some herb salad. This looks a bit worse for wear. That and the kale and the spinach all got a bit bruised in my bag, but it happens. I've got some red uh, of the Albert Rooster potatoes and a bag of Morris Pie potatoes. One of those will be for dinner today for, I'll probably do mash actually, um, and some will be for meal prep. I've got some sweet potatoes, I've got a recipe in mind for those. Over here I've got a honeydew melon, that's just to chop up for snacking on. Some raspberries and some plums. I think they were on special offer, they weren't one of the specials but they were on offer, I think they might have been 79p. Um, I think too bad. I've got another pack of mini easy peelers but they're the small ones. Two packs of pink lady apples, I am not by the kids ones but the kids ones are really tiny today so I've bought the full size ones which they are a bit pricey but we all do seem to like those. I bought a head of broccoli, I bought some baby plum tomatoes because they're still on special. I bought some normal white onions and some celery, that's for going into soup and stews. I've got some bananas down there and a swede, that's so that if I wanted to have a bit more of an SP kind of day I could have that as mash rather than potato. I've got some mushrooms and some baby corn because they're speed. I've got some sugar snack peas, they were on special. I don't know if I even know if I like them, but I've seen quite a few people snacking on them, so I've picked some of those up. I've got a cucumber and some spring onions and some garlic. This is actually quite a big pack, it's got like four in it. Um, and I've got a butternut squash and a lettuce. So that's all the fruit and veg kind of stuff. Obviously loads of speed in there, which is really good to have in. I've got the 0% Greek yogurt, which is the one that's a bit like the Faye one. I've got normal, natural, fat-free yoghurt, just for using in recipes, and some quark. I've got four of these, these are, oh, I've got a wasp in. Just let me deal with that wasp and then I'll be back with you. Sorry about 
Sorry about that. There's no way I wanted a rogue wasp hanging around whilst I'm doing this. Not if you, not if you watch the two Simbries because he got stung during the week. And as soon as I saw that wasp hanging around, I was like, no, he's got to go. So I've just wafted it out outside. Um, I think I was at this point. So I bought four of these Brooklier protein pots. Um, I think these are one sin each. Um, I'll double check and I'll put it on screen. I haven't scanned them in. I've bought them before. I know they're fairly low. They're either half or one, but I think they might be one. Um, I bought a raspberry, a peach and passion fruit, and two vanilla. I bought two packs of the lighter kids cheeses. We really like these because they melt really nicely. If you put them over a chili or something like that, or even on a burger, um, you can have two of these for a healthy extra age. So I bought two packs because they seem to be very popular with everybody. Two packs of the wafer thin honey roast ham. Obviously, that's sin free, I think. I ought to check that actually, just to make sure it's still sin free, but it's wafer thin, so I'm going to count it as free anyway. Um, I bought a bottle of skim milk because that's what we all drink. It's so noisy at my house, sounds like Grand Hatch. Um, I've got some spreadable Nor Pack Lighter. I normally buy Clover Light, but obviously they don't sell that in Aldi. And this was on offer, and it's like the Lure Pack, so I just thought I'd treat us to some of that. Um, I bought lighter mature cheese which should be for me and mild cheddar for everybody else so that's this lot there's still quite a lot to go so bear with me and i shall keep going so over here i've got a six pack of diet lemonade i actually bought some of these splendid syrups from home bargains and i thought if i mixed in um, some gin with some lemonade and some of that palm violet flavor it might be quite nice so i bought those to try that I've got Tropical Blasts, which are obviously free, and the Zero Cola, which is like the Max Fake. I've also bought this, I've not seen this before, this is a protein granola, apricot and cranberry. Now I've scanned, tried to scan this in and I can't find it, and I've tried to do a search and I can't find it. But the other foodie market granolas are around six, and most protein granolas are between five and a half and six for 25 grams. So I'm probably gonna count it as that. I might put it in this estimator if I get a chance, but, um, I probably will just wave it out and have it with my yogurt and fruit in the morning just to bulk it out a little bit. Um, but I thought it might be quite nice and a bit more filling with it being a protein one. I bought some face wipes just for taking makeup off because I normally get them in Primark and I haven't been to Primark since lockdown because there's always a queue. I've got a four pack of beans because they're handy to stock up with. I've got some of the spicy red kidney beans to put in the chilli. I've bought three tins of chopped tomatoes. These are just the cheap ones because I tend to chuck it into soups and stews and things like that i bought some garlic puree as well because they, they never have this in it's like gold dust normally they're left with the ginger and whatever but um they actually have some today so i thought i'll get some to put in the fridge while it's there um i've got some of the taco mixed beans and tomato sauce these are free on the plan and they're really nice to add to chilies and things like that i've got a passata just to stock up because i use one and i you know i don't know i don't know how many if i've got any left of it or not but some honey. I've also got two packs of the well, a salted caramel and a fudge brownie of the fibre now. Um, with the basis that I like these for pudding heated in the microwave. But also Ewan's back at school and I'm back at work this week so it might be handy just to grab and go. These are three and a half sins for the salted caramel. They're still not in the app but they are more or less the same calories so I'd probably count them the same still. Um, I've bought some juice. Just, I think it's a sugar free one. Double strength so that's not for me anyway really it's for everyone else i've got some unsweetened almond milk because hopefully this week i'm going to try and make my rice pudding um i've got some blackcurrant preserve um i quite like things like that on toast and in um rice pudding and things probably not the healthiest but i really fancied some of that so i've treated myself to some some tomato puree because i know i've run out some spaghetti because i know we've run out i actually bought four packs of the microwave basmati rice this is two cents for the whole pouch I'm sure it used to be two and a half actually, but I've just scanned it in and it came up as two. Um, these are on offer, these I think 35p for a pouch, which I thought was brilliant. So I picked pick them up just to stick in the cupboard. I've also got some jasmine rice, which I think this was, I don't think this is a special from the middle of the aisle. Um, but I quite like jasmine rice, so I've picked some of that up, meal prep. I've also got some white rice because I know I've run out. And some lady items because I've run out. Next I've bought... 24 of the large free range eggs because we've got one egg left i've also bought some of these now i've seen these on a couple of other channels so i thought i'd try them there's the moroccan style falafel 
These are five cents for half a pack. It's 200 gram pack, so for half. I don't know how many have got in a pack. It looks like there's probably nine. Um, but yeah, so, and then I bought some of the sweet potato pakora. Now this is coming up as eight for the whole pack. Um, so I think both of those are pretty good. I used to quite like having um, a roll with um, falafels, lettuce and mango chutney or onion chutney in. So I might think about doing something like that again. Um, I bought two packs of skinny sausages because we all eat those and like them. Two packs of back bacon. Um, obviously when it's trimmed it's free. I've got an extra large chicken that's for today's Sunday dinner. I've got some turkey mince and some pork mince. This is both lean ones. That's 2% fat turkey mince. That's free. And the 5% fat pork mince. That is for a meal prep that I'm doing for breakfast. Um, so I'll show you that when I make it. I've got the lean minced beef. This is the one kilogram pack. Um, so it'll either do two dinners or it'll be one dinner, but I'll be able to freeze some. I bought two of the two kilogram packs of chicken because I haven't had these this couple of times I've been in, but these were on offer and it's really reasonably priced. So I've picked them up to obviously do some for this week's dinners and some to put in the freezer. I bought two lots of flavoured water. Ewan doesn't like plain water and he's back at school and they're not allowed to use the fountains because of COVID. So I bought those for him for during the week for school. I've picked up a chip tray. Now I don't do my chips in the oven. I do do crispy kale and things like butternut squash and stuff in the oven. So I picked it up for that. I can't remember how much this was. It was one of the center aisle specials, but I quite like the fact that it was a rectangle rather than it being just a round one like they usually are. So I picked that up. I picked up the Malta Bloomer, which I love. I love this isn't for me to have. Toasty white, again, not for me. I bought a pack of these Whitworth shots. These are really nice. These are four and a half cents for a pack. But they're quite nice if you stir them through porridge or just have them for snacking on. Right, I bought some chocolate bar snacks. This is for work and school for people. So the caramel wackos, they're five cents each. The caramel wafers, they're six and a half. Chunkies, which um, I think they're like club biscuits and I've written it on somewhere. Oh, it's hiding on there. That is six and a half. And some choco breaks, which is like your Kit Kats, and they're five and a half. So they're all just to stock up the snack bag and hopefully won't get eaten all in one go. I've picked up some bake at home rolls. These are six for the brown ones. Um, I don't know why it's not a healthy extra B, whether it's too big or not, but six sins is the usual sort of sinage for a healthy extra B. So whether or not I just decide to treat it as one, I may do that because I'm naughty like that. I've picked up some white ones. Um, this is the four pack of four, so it's like the half baguette. These are quite high. These are ten cents for one of these, and I bought the full uh, little sort of baguette ones. And I think this was ten and a half. It's actually rubbed off, so I can't remember. But I'm sure it's something like ten and a half. I knew there wasn't a huge difference between the little ones and the big one. Um, but obviously they're not for me anyway, so. Um, I've picked up some bagel thins. Um, these are the only ones they have in Aldi. They don't have the seeded ones. So again, I'm tempted to be naughty just for me and treat that as a healthy extra B just because I don't want to shop somewhere else on top of Aldi because I've spent so much in here. Um, obviously, if I do that, I'm doing it my way. You don't have to copy me. Um, I've also got some rainbow drops. This is four bags. I'm not sure how big the bags are inside, but these are five and a half sins. So again, it's just to add to my snack bag. And that's everything I've bought, which I do actually think I've got a lot for my money, a hell of a lot for my money. And obviously it is more than one week shop. A lot of the stuff is to stock up my cupboards and things. So, so yeah, I'm really, really pleased with how much I've got for my money. Yeah, I don't think that's bad at all, considering. This will be for um, five adults. I mean, Ewan isn't an adult yet, but he eats the same amount as an adult. So if this is for five adults. So um, you have to appreciate that when you see how much I'm making. Um, and like I say, like the chicken and stuff, that isn't just for this week. That will be for more than this week. So yeah, I hope you've enjoyed my shopping haul. Um, if you're interested in what I'm going to make for meal prep, obviously look out for that video. I'm hopefully going to record it this afternoon. Um, so that will probably go up tomorrow or Tuesday, I'd have thought. Um, probably tomorrow because obviously I'll be eating the stuff for my white eating a days and it'll be a bit daft to have that on if you don't know what I've made. So so yeah, I'm going to put this all away now and I shall see you again next time for the next one. Bye.